Okay, hi. Hi there. What's up? start the video I wanted to show everybody this outfit. It's thrifted and I think everybody needs to get into it. Thrifty. It's real. It's great. You can get some good shit. So we have this dress and it's longer. Put a cropped sweater over it that I drew on. If you can see that well enough. I got this dress for a Halloween costume, Daphne, so we got a Scooby-Doo theme going on. I was going to wear it to a company work party, but I bailed because my grandma's cooking. And I just didn't want to be with Denver because it's sketch as hell. So we have the outfit, right? The wig was a pleasant surprise. Um it up in a bun for the first time it's usually very long and I guess I should preface this video by saying I have alopecia very bad. You can see. gotcha so this looks normal right let's see let's bring her back down to earth just clipped her up with a little clip and Nice and puffy. I'm probably gonna have to wash it because it's a rat's nest. It's, I almost said rat's nest. It's just a rat's nest, so no biggie. Usually I wake up at 5.30. Um, if I'm feeling kind of slow the night before, then I'll sleep in until 6. But I usually pick 5.30 because if I lay in bed any longer, I'll stay there forever. And girls got things to do. It all feels worth it in the end. It's kind of shitty when you first wake up and you say, why? Why did I choose this? Why can't I just sleep in? But then I get going doing my yoga and my workouts and it amps me, amps me up for life. I'm like pumped, ready to get the day on. I already feel like a freaking Olympian. Like I just trained like Rocky. And I'm ready to fight some work. I'm going to punch some emails. You know what they say? Um, so, yeah. I usually don't get ready. But like I said, I ditched a company meal. Because it was happy hour. And I don't drink on the weekends. Or on the weekdays. So it's complicated. I have this cookie that my grandma made. I don't know if you can see it. It's peanut butter. I love when they put the chocolate in the middle. I think it's very, very soft with the cookie. It's like what kind of witchcraft is going on here, but whatever it is, I'm into it. My alarm is not like the typical chiming alarm. It is a little melody that plays as I'm waking up. Sometimes I wake up before it and I think, hmm, I knew this was coming. And there's no surprise element here. I'm already on top of the game. I'm ready. I'm pumped. This is the word on the street. I wake up hella early. And ever since I started about a year ago, I felt a lot more productive during the day and like I see a whole different type of day. It's very dark, everything's very quiet and there's just like nothing else to worry about but what I've already planned and I can properly prepare for my day because life sometimes you just gotta Get ready early as fuck in the morning and say, let's do it again today and make the best of it. So, I'll see you in the morning. Howdy.
take it off with a good stretch and then move into some Pilates or bar. So you'll see the fast forward version. It'll look like I'm moving at a million miles an hour. And we'll do it like this. worked out so I just worked out for the gouds I'm gonna put on my makeup for the day so we're going to the dentist and then we'll get the heck out of here because I'm kind of pushing it with this time today so it's my lime cream palette I got this at the doctor's office because I'm a child this Lancome palette love My aunt and mom gave it to me. It's very pretty. And of course, naked too, so that I can draw on these brows. I've been drawing on my eyebrows for about five years. Sometimes they grow back and I don't have to Right now, they're kind of growing back, so it makes it hard to get super precise, super precise lines. But we make do. I just make this brush as thin as possible to get some realistic hairs. Sometimes I want to do just really big bushy eyebrows for fun because it's kind of a look. There's the first one. The other one is growing back a little bit slower. So there's less hair making it easier to draw on an eyebrow. I'm sure you guys can see in the light all my fuzzies. I got a lot of fuzzies going on up here. Um, taking some pills from a study, the alopecia study. I see right here it's getting darker. I'm thinking that it's starting to grow back some pigment. So oh, that's the eyebrows. Those are done. I just drag it out. Done. It's L'Oreal. My eyelashes are real, surprisingly. I think my eyes um, made a decision with the alopecia and were like, hey, we can't be getting dust and crap in our eyeballs constantly, so can you pull it together, bud? So they've never fallen out. They're my OGs. And then I'll just do this up. There we go. So Let's do an outfit change. Got this 
Pasen el mismo. Baseball. Now I'm gonna get my wig on. So it's the final change, BRB. Okay. So let's fix this. I'm gonna do kind of what I did yesterday. Put it up in a bun. Just kind of have to gather it gently so you don't rip it off your head and snatch yourself. Okay, no worries. And I don't usually do updos with long wigs because they will slide down my head. But this one worked out surprisingly well to get as many little baby hairs as we can. Look at her work. Cute. Cute. Need a little bit more color. Holy moly. Okay, so here's the fit. hit a runner you guys would be like um motion me reporter yes please feel free to if i ever commit a crime on camera Anytime I turn on the windshield, windshield heater, it goes ape shit. Like, brrrr. okay, Jill. I don't need my windows cleared in five seconds. I just want peace. I want peace on earth. I'm not going to be late. I didn't brush my teeth. I'm usually pretty good about brushing my teeth every morning because I do have a husband and he likes to give me kisses in the morning and I don't want to be like, hi, hi there, buddy. The dentist, they've seen worse, definitely. They have definitely seen worse. There's people in the street. Get out of the street. Oh, it was an old lady. Okay, well, she can do whatever she wants. So what do I think about the morning time? I love it. It's so just humbling because you think my god I would have been asleep for this hour and a half doing jack 
just jack shit nothing which is not bad the body needs rest 1000 percent. the body needs rest or else you're going to strain something but if you can push yourself just a little bit harder on certain days of the week then you can see it catch up to you like i started with just waking up 10 minutes earlier every day with my workouts do a 10 little minute yoga situation and now i wake up a full like two hours before i have to go to work so it's a it's a journey one that you're going on with yourself by the way No one's ever going to make you get up earlier than you have to. This person, are you going to go? Fuck. Trying to enjoy my fucking banana, man. Your dentist is going to have a, just a job ahead of him. I also told my work that I was going to be doing this. I was going to like ask, but my bosses never fucking answer. It's like they're screening my message and they're like, if I don't answer, then she just will come into work at the same time. Not today. Okay, let's see. Fuck yes. Okay, I have 40 minutes. Four minutes. We've had 40 minutes. I brought some hot water. It was going to be cold. But then when I was looking at it filling in the cup, there was steam. And I didn't have time, so I just ran with it. So we'll see how, how awkward that is. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all. Y'all. I was hungry. Just try waking up early. Oh. I like having days like this where I have like an appointment. It makes me feel I have somewhere to be. Like I'm a boss. Bitch. I have errands to run. People that require my presence, you know? I'm gonna drink the shit out of this water, so there's not a ton of bread in my teeth. I choose peanut butter. Um, I have two minutes. <sighs> okay. I think my grandma has gum in here. I think my grandma has gum. Okay, that'll get it. Yeah, I'll get the rest of it. Okay, y'all. Fur! It's cold! My teeth are clean. They're fucking clean, everyone. They're so clean, I could gleam like the sun in the sky. Can you see? The dentist said that I should maybe get, oh! I'm gonna go this way. I don't know about everybody else, but I will take a stoplight 
into a open intersection for can't tell if I have to pee super bad or I am cold and getting the shivers. Uh, maybe a little bit of balls and a little bit of bacon. Um, yeah, the doctor said I should get a retainer, possibly. I don't want to. My wisdom teeth are still present and accounted for. Present and accounted for, they're embedded. So I might just keep those girls handy in case I ever need them. Need to whip them out at any time. So, yeah, it's 8.29. I'm gonna get back to my office at about 8.40, which is good. It means I'll only have to work eight, 40 hours. Y'all, I swear I'm not drunk or anything. I only have to work 40 extra minutes today. And yeah, so I'll work 40 extra minutes. Get there, Dern. Hang out with Graham. Watch Jeopardy. Do my thing. Do a little yoga. I love the woman who cleans my teeth. She's the best. She is so sweet. She doesn't um, hacksaw murder my gums when she's cleaning them very gentle she is very talkative and it makes me feel bad because I'm such a people pleaser I'm like ooh, I really wish that I could reciprocate the energy you're giving me but I have a tool in my mouth yeah and it's not my husband hey yo ooh, got him working this whole time and I got to be at the dentist so it's probably a little jealous yeah the dentist has probably the most perfect teeth I've ever seen they are pearly white they almost look like veneers don't no judgment to him no judgment at all but maybe it's because he was smiling so much that I was like Seems like you have a deep-seated need to show me how good your teeth are because they're veneers. But I don't fucking know. I don't know him. I don't know his story. I won't. I won't pass judge, judgment upon thee. So yeah, I'm so happy I got the seat warmer on because I was freezing. That's what I get for wearing this light. What, the, what would you call this? It's not even a hoodie. It's barely a hoodie. It has a hood, but it's so thin. Anyways, I was not cutting it today. I was freezing my balls off. Anyways, that was my morning routine for Wednesday, January. 16th. See, I know things. Um, I'll usually do the same thing, but without the getting ready part, I usually wash my face after I work out. So we'll see if I have a breakout because <laughs> I was kind of in a rush, as you saw. I didn't plan it out very but it worked. I love getting to places on time and I'm either early or on the dot. My husband, on the other hand, has a vendetta to make me late to anything he is also attending with me. So I don't have a perfect record anymore.
Goldikins. I'm not on a diet, I just like shitting. Is that a crime? <laughs>